Hundreds of people took to the Boston Common this afternoon to protest marijuana laws despite recent changes in Massachusetts. Leaders of the movement still believe the laws are too strict. And he sees John Roney is in the newsroom with more. John? Christy, this event has been a real source of controversy over the years, but a lot of the legal opposition went up in smoke last fall thanks to Massachusetts voters. Waiting to exhale on the Boston Common during a rally advocating the legalization of marijuana. Mike Cann is a member of the Massachusetts Cannabis Reform Coalition. I have 8 million supporters now because I got involved. Our attendance has grown because of music and the cause and the question too. And I think the biggest change is that now people know we can change the law. That we're not just a bunch of idiots out here. That we can actually get things done. The 2009 Freedom Rally comes nearly one year after voters in the Bay State passed question two a ballot initiative that makes the possession of an ounce of marijuana or less a civil infraction, punishable by a $100 fine. The next big push for the coalition, medical marijuana. We've had this great leap forward as far as possession goes. Now we can shift our focus to the tens of thousands of Massachusetts citizens suffer from horrible maladies and could find relief easily by growing a little free marijuana in their backyard. The rally is 20 years old and on three separate occasions organizers had to go into court to get permission to hold it here on the common. It is now one of the largest festivals of its kind on the East Coast. Public opinion about marijuana is changing. Question two passed with 65 percent back in November. We decriminalized marijuana. It's no longer a crime. People can't get arrested. At one year 150 people were arrested and booked in processing tents right over there. There's not even a processing tent there this year. You know, that says a lot. Now, Boston police are, re are reporting very few problems on the common. Christie, by late afternoon, they say they had issued about 100 tickets to rally goers while arresting about three others for distribution of marijuana. All right, John Maroney reporting. Thank you.